Okay, but let's move on. Even though we love to talk about Ruby, let's talk about <laughs> TV host Carson Daly says he and his wife Siri have figured out the key to staying together. What's their secret? Yeah. Sleeping apart. <laughs> idea of sleep divorce. <laughs> okay, so here's the thing. I think it, overall, um, sleep has got to be prioritized better for all of us. Yeah, sure, right? yeah. If I can talk to the menopausal women in the room, um, we need sleep because we are struggling. <laughs> raise okay. your hands, ladies, but, raise your hands. Yes, raise your hands. Thank you, Andrea. <laughs> However, to me, this is the beginning of the end. If this is really? gonna be your new oh MO as a relationship, to me, being in the bedroom, provided that you don't have things like televisions and phones and trinkets and all those things. Yeah. To me, the nighttime is when you're able to connect with your partner. You unload your day, you download your day, you reconnect in a way that there are no distractions. Hopefully the kids are in bed, the pets are sleeping, and you're able to be together. The second that you decide we're gonna spend this really sacred and quiet, peaceful time together mm. apart, I think it's a slippery slope mm. to too much Okay. Now, I believe in time but apart. What if they're, what if it's too much time apart. What if apart? they're getting that download? Right? I don't know. Okay. What if they're getting that download at dinner time, for example? Yeah. Like It's yeah. different because there's so much chaos. There's things running around. You're running around. You're doing the dishes, the kids, the television. Okay. There's so many distractions. We're a really distracted society. Yeah. There's few places left that are sacred enough to have a connection with no but distractions. But do you and your partner fall asleep at the same time every single night? Because suppose you go to bed at 8 yeah. and he goes to bed at 9. I'm just picking those numbers. You're gonna have an issue because one person's ready to download but the other person perhaps wants to continue to binge watch their show. So what right. do you do in that situation? Right. I think you can still have a few moments. It doesn't have to be three hours talking. God, who wants to talk to their partner for three hours? <laughs> <laughs> but, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. But I, uh, just kidding. But what if it's just like a once a month thing? I don't think this is an every night thing. It was like a once a month, once every two sure. weeks thing. I think it's okay. I would love take a little break from my husband. Like, he, it's fine, we love each other, but yeah. like, he can go and do his own thing. We can't, because we have just a one bedroom condo, unfortunately. Right, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So we're kind of stuck together. Yeah, yeah. But hey, then I can be alone and, and read my hockey smut and he won't judge me. Yeah. Or I can, yeah. you know, I've been into ASMR lately. That's a little weird, I realize, but I feel him I judging that. me yeah. when I'm doing that. I, I feel that. like okay. you have a good voice for ASMR, but oh, that's another yeah. topic. Okay, how are you, how are you and Simon is, sleeping? Simon and I sleep in a double bed. Like we have, oh. we've done that for like twins? twins, like like tw like a you know not twin beds, like a full. They call it a full or a double. So it's one size smaller than That's a queen. That's cozy. There's it's no room for tossing and turning. Right. There's no tossing or turning. I absolutely love it, and I think it's because we wow. download at the dinner table, okay. and we make a point not to have distractions around the dinner table, mm -hmm. and we don't have kids or pets, so it's just That's, like oh yeah. let's let's download mm. together. But it's also because I don't see him during the day. I'm gone mm. for most of the day. Okay. So when I get home, I'm like the puppy. Yeah. What'd you do? Where'd you go? Yeah. What, what, Oh, Here's what I did, let's talk. That's and cute. so the idea then of not sleeping with them is just like, but That's I only so had sad. four hours with you today at home. Yeah. Wow. Wow. I'm not talking the whole time. Well, I'm the opposite. We're doing it the whole time. <laughs> I, uh, you guys are doing it in no. that twin bed? No, that's, that's <laughs> well, you're right there. You literally yeah. right there. Um, uh, <laughs> okay. like roll. So give me the Okay, I, my dream husband <laughs> wants to sleep in a separate room with me, from Yay. me. And even if I'm really lucky, a separate house. I think the killer of relationships, I'm the opposite, is spending too much time and, and too much being around their clutter and, yeah. and being fussed about, you know, fussing about the toilet seat's not down yes. and you leave your socks here. Yeah. But if you do that at your house, yeah and I have my house and I have mm, my mm. things the way they are, I think we're going to last forever. That's all I'm saying. Oh my God, yeah, yeah, yeah. Listen, yeah. if you're a, as I mentioned, if you're a menopause woman, hold up your fan. <laughs> when you know that night sweat and you're tossing and turning, the last thing you want is another like hot body next to you. So Bring on idea... that hot body. I love hot bodies. <laughs> She's talking now, let that menopause hit her. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hot oh, no, no, no. The nice sweats are real, Andrea. Yeah. Hey there, what did you think? Drop your comments below and join the conversation. And don't forget to like and subscribe so you can find more on everything from food and fashion to pop culture and current events. See you soon.